What's up? Welcome back to my channel. I'm Brandy, and you're watching The Glam Bell, and today we have another curly hair video. I am finally testing out and reviewing the Love Your Curls brand. So many of you guys have asked me, have you tried the LUS brand? Have you tried the Lust brand? Have you tried the Love Your Curls brand? And my answer was always, no, I have not tried it, but I really want to because a lot of you keep asking me. And thanks to one of you guys that tagged the Love Your Curls brand in one of my Instagram posts, they actually reached out to me and said, hey, if you've never tried our brand, we would love to send you some products to try out. Here we are. This is not a sponsored video, but this is me giving you my honest review and opinion of the brand because so many of you have asked me to review it. A lot of people constantly ask me, have I tried it? But not many curly hair influencers talk about this brand. I haven't really seen any videos or reviews or anything on this particular brand. So I think in my mind, I was assuming that maybe the products had sulfate or silicone in it and that's why I didn't see a lot of curly hair reviews on it but to my surprise all of their products are sulfate, silicone, paraben, paraffin, phthalate, propylene glycol, mineral oil, gluten, synthetic dye, and colorant free. It literally is Curly Girl Method approved and it is free of all of the junk that we don't want in our hair products. They basically have a three-step simplified curly hair system and it comes with a shampoo and conditioner and both of these products are good for all hair types, whether you have wavy, curly, kinky, coily, anything. These are good for everyone. Then they have a styler, which is an all-in-one styler. They have three different ones. So they do have a styler for wavy hair. They have a styler for curly hair and then they have one for coily hair. I think that's really kind of genius because obviously, you know, you can get away with having one kind of shampoo and conditioner, but having one specific styler for all hair types usually doesn't work because obviously our hair types are so, so different. So the question is, what did I think of these products? Did the curly line work for my type three hair, is this the results or did I actually have to use a different product to get these results? You have to stay tuned to the end of the video to find out. And you already know I have to say it, if you're not subscribed to my channel already, hit that subscribe button down there. Make sure to hit the bell so that you're notified when I upload videos here on YouTube. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into this Love Your Curls hair review. The first step in this system is to cleanse the hair and I'm going in with their sulfate free shampoo. The shampoo is very thick in consistency. It almost has like a gel like feel to it. A little bit goes a long way. I definitely used too much of this, but the shampoo is formulated with shea butter and moringa oil and it definitely gets sudsy on the head. You can see here, I'm using my shampoo brush to get it all in there, but this product smells so, so good. All right, all right, so the shampoo definitely impressed me. I'm not gonna lie, it definitely did the trick. If you do have finer curly hair like mine, then you don't need a lot of this product. A little bit definitely goes a long way. It suds up really, really well, and it definitely felt hydrating on my hair, but still got my hair very, very clean. So definitely impressed, but, but, but will the conditioner live up? to the cleanser. We will find out. Step two, it is time to condition the hair and I'm going in with their silicone free conditioner also formulated with shea butter and moringa oil. This is also a very thick formula so you only need to use however much your hair needs. I definitely used way too much of this and you'll see as I start to detangle but this formula is super super hydrating and I was able to detangle my hair so fast it was crazy. You can see it on my face. I'm like shocked at how easy I was able to detangle my hair but you can see how coated my hair is this product will definitely last me a little while because now I know I don't need to use nearly as much to be able to detangle my hair but I'm impressed I have no complaints I mean the conditioner worked exactly as it said it would it detangled my hair probably easier than most of the conditioners that I've tried out there. And both of these products smell incredible. I love finding an awesome cleanser and shampoo, which these totally are. But the real test for getting the best results always lies in the styler for me. I feel like I can use any type of shampoo and conditioner, and if I do not have a good styler, 
I'm not gonna get the best results. We are putting the whole system to the test right here and using this all-in-one styler because you guys know I am a cream and then a gel girl. I like to layer my products. I like to have a gel for hold. But with this product, it says that you do not need to use a gel because this will actually give you the hold. Love that it's one step, but will it actually work? Let's go ahead and find out right now. Now it's time for step three, which is the styling product. We are going in with their all-in-one styling product for curly hair. This product is definitely a little bit thinner in consistency, and it does say that the product needs to be activated by water and must be applied to wet, clean hair, which is what I would normally do anyway. Again, I wanna reiterate how amazing these products smell. So I did exactly what it said to do, applied it in my hair, and then I also added a little bit more water Water before going in with my Denman brush. I have a full video on exactly how I style using my Denman brush. I just wanted to show you guys a little clip. Then I went in with my hair repair towel to scrunch and now it is time to diffuse my hair. This is what it looked like before drying. And I went ahead and included the entire video of me diffusing, obviously sped up like crazy so that we don't have to sit here for 25 minutes and watch me diffuse my hair. But I just kind of wanted you guys to see the process even if it was sped up. Um, I'm using the Diva dryer and I'm using the Curly Co diffuser for this and I do change it to the Diva fuser just to get in at my roots. And we're just gonna sit here and finish drying my hair. So here are the results before fluffing, before adding any oil to my hair. These are just the results right after diffusing. And I have to say, I am pretty happy with them. My hair is very soft, very fluffy, and very defined. But you know, I have to go in with my oil to seal in that moisture. So I used the Innate Life's Rose Hair Elixir just to add a little extra shine, lock in that moisture, and hopefully help this style to last in these cold, cold winter months. I definitely did not think that I would be able to skip out on a gel and still get good results, but I do feel like I still got shiny bouncy, very, very soft curls. The only thing that I do wish with this system is that the styler did have a little extra hold because I definitely felt like my hair was almost a little too soft, so I was having a hard time kind of getting volume in there, but I kind of always struggle with that on day one, so I didn't think too much about it. I kind of just thought, let me just wear it for a few days and see how it holds up, see how much I have to refresh, and then we'll go from there. And I'm happy to say that today is day three hair, and all I did today was add a little bit of water. I did not soak my hair or anything, got it just a little bit damp, and I added just a few more pumps of this styling product. I smoothed it over my hair and then I diffused. And this is the results. What do you guys think about this brand? I have to say, you guys, I am so impressed. This is definitely a system that I would totally purchase on my own. Day two, my hair still looked really, really good. It just felt a tiny bit flat. I did use a little bit of texture spray just to give it some grit because sometimes if my hair is too soft, it'll just, it'll just fall flat. And I really like volume. I did go in with this right here. This is the Inner Sense Eye Cream waves salt spray really awesome at giving your hair just a tiny bit of grit and you can actually use this on damp or dry hair and just lightly spray just a few little sprays in there and look at that all I do is just go in and add a few little spritzes of this and you can see right there just it just helps to give it some volume it doesn't like soak your hair or anything it just literally gives it a little extra off look at that I mean, wow. I am obsessed with texture sprays. It just gives my hair so much more volume without like 
adding a ton of hairspray. I really love this. Innersense is one of my favorite, favorite brands. So if you're looking for a good texture spray, this is a good one. Overall, my opinion of the Love Your Curls brand is it is an A plus from me. I'm so glad that I tried this brand out finally and I'm so glad that one of you tagged the company. I'm thankful that they actually sent me these products for free. So shout out to Love Your Curls. Thank you for these products and you have a customer now because I will definitely be coming back for more. That is it for this review. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. And if there's any other brands that are Curly Girl approved that you guys want me to review, definitely leave them in the comments below. And I love you guys so, so much. And I will see you in my next video. Peace out.